I'm Josephine Akia Loyimbazi, the country coordinator for participatory ecological land use management, Pelham, Uganda. Today we are convening the very first Ugandan agroecology entrepreneurs and territorial market actors meeting. The whole background of this convening is to bring together farmers, producers, processors, value chain actors, business development service providers, um, government who is basically the Ministry of Trade, Industry and Cooperatives, certifying bodies, academia and the media to brainstorm on the different issues that are affecting our agroecology producers. Currently, the production of agroecology is increasing and this is attributed to the consumer awareness that most of us have played in ensuring that the population in Uganda, but also regionally within the East African community and internationally, eat healthy, sustainably, and nutritious foods. And this can only be gotten if you are practicing agroecology. We promote the production of different agroecological products, ranging from vegetables, spices, agro-inputs, like biorationals and fertilizers to ensure that we are sustainably utilizing our natural resources and we are not degrading our natural environment. Increasingly, we saw the need to link the different agroecology actors to different markets. And we started, we are starting with our very own local markets. Today we have chairpersons of different markets within Uganda. We have the Nakawa market represented, we have Vusega market represented, we have Natete and Kasubi markets represented. These are some of the territorial markets in Uganda. And a territorial market is one that is characterized with agri agricultural food products, fresh food products that are easy for somebody to access and consume. However, when you go into these markets, it's next to hardly that will you see a stall that is labeled agriculture, agroecology, or organic products only. Why don't we develop the local market? Why don't we focus on selling to my neighbor, selling to someone within the city, someone within the country, before we try to go global and, 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 and global or international for these products? I've seen where fruits are taken out so outside of Uganda. However, there are so many parts in Uganda that are already demanding fruits that are healthy and organically or agroecologically produced. Let's develop the local market first. 